Hi guys! Hi guys! I have Michelle back on my channel. I'm so happy. And if you don't know, now Michelle lives in Dubai. Yes! <laughs> Finally! Yeah, it's amazing. So expect to see a lot more content coming from us. Oh yes. I think we're gonna do a lot of filming together. I think so too. <laughs> <laughs> I make sure that they get the boobs right now. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I was wearing something like completely covered and Michelle and I said, was no! We no. need to give my dirty bastards something. <laughs> yeah. well, they're mine actually, but... They're also a little bit mine. <laughs> there are probably okay. some of mine in there as well. There is. <laughs> so we're also going to do something over on Michelle's channel of me yeah. smelling... She brought like a huge bag I of did. fragrances. And she couldn't see what was in there. Yeah, so I'm excited to go over and smell them. I will leave that video, if you post it before me, link down if below. If you like the leads, the video. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Let's just get into it. I have a bunch of like new-ish fragrances that I love right now on men. Also some old favorites, just basically things that I don't think Michelle has smelled, which is difficult to find. Yeah. Because she smelled pretty much everything. So I'm trying to shock her. I'm trying to see like a 10 out of 10 reaction because I feel like you didn't even give one fragrance a 10 out of 10 in the last video. No, I didn't. So hoping for a 10 out of 10. Hoping for a 10 out of 10. <laughs> Let's go ahead and get into it. Okay. Okay. Ready? Yes. Okay. Let's see what you got here. Candy. Candy? Fe candy feminine. Okay. Yeah. Candy feminine. Are we judging it for a man or a woman? For a man. For a man. Oh, it's also it's cardamom in there. I smell something spicy. Okay. It's getting, okay, it's getting like candy and it was feminine, but now it's getting to the spicy kind of red because this is the opening. Okay. I like it. It's sweet, a little bit spicy. It's nice. Okay. I would give this an eight. Okay, so yeah. you like it. I like it. I like it a lot, but this is more for just office every day, but a sexy office fragrance. Okay, sexy office fragrance. Sexy office. Yeah. I'll take that. Amouage Enclave. Oh, I've never smelled that one. Okay, because I think it's like a really mass appealing fragrance from Amouage, which is difficult to come across. I feel like Amouage, their juice is like super yeah. uh, oriental, a lot of frankincense, very resonant. It's more like art. Clave is more of like a mass appealing Amouage, so I wanted to see what yeah. your thoughts on it are. No, eight. That Amouage I like. Hold it together. Yeah. At least till the end of the video. Or so. Okay. Oh, this is more my thing. It's more spicy. More thing. I knew it. I feel like I'm understanding Michelle's taste Ooh. now. I know what gets her excited. This gets me excited. I know. <laughs> gets you excited as well? Yeah, Ooh. come on. I'll show you the bottle after I wear it a lot. Well, I wear it. Oh, this is really good. Mm. So, uh, for winter. Mm -hmm. Yeah, every day in the winter. That's really good. It's, it's like an amber, a little bit smoky, mm -hmm. spicy. Oh, I like this a lot. Nine cool. and a half. Yeah. Oh! Yeah, this is really good. It's really good. Claps, claps, claps. Yeah, this is almost, almost dropping my panties. Oh! <laughs> we almost got a panty dropper. We almost a panty dropper. <laughs> okay. It like gets my top off. Alright, uh, oh, it gets the top off. It gets the top. The bra as well? Or just the top? No, the bra. Okay. Yeah. Okay. But you don't wear a bra. No, you <laughs> <laughs> This okay. one was Veni Havan. Oh, it's really Les good. Les Have you tried it? Uh, no. I haven't. It's I don't even know amazing. This is amazing juice, you guys. Like amazing. If you want a vanilla tobacco, in my humble opinion, it's probably one of the best on the market as a vanilla tobacco. No, scent. I think uh, it's yes, crazy. It is. And the yeah. longevity projection. Sure. Ten out of ten. Nine point five. <laughs> <laughs> this is not my thing because really? it, yeah, it smells like something you would wear to the office. I do wear this one to the office. You see, you don't even have an office. What the fuck? <laughs> Actually, I do. You do? Don't insult me. We have a shared office. Oh, a shared office, okay. It's a shared office. Co working okay. space. You actually complimented me on this fragrance the last time I saw you. <laughs> That's what I mean. You see, if Debbie wears it, then you're like, wow. But if an average girl would wear it, like, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's okay. okay. But if you wear it, but that's because you are already sexy. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> it's because of that. No, with okay, this one. I smelled this on you when you came to my house, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Nine. That's mm -hmm. a nine. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So that's really good. And it didn't smell feminine on you. It smelled no, masculine. No, on no, no. It's 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 a perfectly unisex citrus for me. 
huge compliment girl i literally have never received so many compliments than i have with vibrato from sospiro okay it that's not feminine no it's no. not it's not feminine nor is it like extremely masculine it's just an amazing citrus yeah. scent um i never shut up about it but guys literally this is my most complimented fragrance and i'm so happy that it's getting more popular now online because it's a vibrator to the ladies yes it exactly. vibrates in the good places it vibrates in the good places i watched your video by the way you're talking about it <laughs> Oh, paper, it came off a little bit different, but uh, nine, nine and a half. Nine? Nine and a half. Nine and a half? Okay. Yeah, okay. yeah. For Dubai weather, nine and a half, if you wear that in the summer, yeah. it's super sexy. Yeah. And I saw some men now reviewing it, and all of them are loving this fragrance, so... For sure. To me, this smells like... It's a molecule-ish? Mm-hmm, definitely. Okay. Boring. I would oh. use this to layer. Yeah. Okay, but not on itself. Okay. So, five. Okay, fair comment. Fair comment. I do layer it, actually. Okay. I don't usually wear this one by myself, although Pierre does. Okay, yeah, it's like it, a molecule citrus? Yeah, kind of. Okay. It's a molecule, molecule like, base fragrance. Um, I'll show you which one it is. Yeah. It's called An Ud. An Ud from Obvious. Okay. Uh, which is like an eco-friendly, completely brand. But this one, honestly, you guys, on the skin, the projection of this one is insane. Like it projects like a fuck off. Yeah, like, but that's what a molecule does. Yeah. And that's what I like. And that's yeah. what smells so good in the air. Like on the test strip, you can smell it and be like, it doesn't smell like anything. Yeah. But the magic is on the skin. But I, I see what you mean. I'll take yeah. a five. It's okay. Molecule uh, fragrances has to be on skin. It doesn't come off. On no, paper. exactly. Half as good as uh, what it is. But. Exactly. Yeah. Okay. Okay. A so five. Yeah, a five for for now. Okay. Ooh, I have this. I think it smells like um, rose and mustard. Does it come off? <laughs> <laughs> Did this turns the top off for you? No. Oh. But it's nice. I like it on the. I like it fresh out of the shower, and then I would wear this. What? Getting into action. Really? Yeah. Nice and clean. <laughs> I like the body nice and clean before I'm about to do some action. What do you get? Like some saffron. But I know the nodes, so maybe that's why. There that's is some it. fruitiness, there is some saffron, and I think like very woody base to this one. Oh no, not at all. For me but it's like I agree. Musk, it's molecule. Very musky, very fresh. Out of the shower, getting in some action, eight. You like it a lot? Yeah. Oh, cool. Yeah. Okay, eight for that one. So this was Rialto from Gritty. No, very good. You like it? Yeah, cool. on a okay. man and woman, doesn't matter. Yeah, I agree, it's yeah. very unisex. Actually, this was Erica's, when she came to film with me, her top, one of her top fragrances. She had this one and another one as her top two. Yeah, it's a yeah. good one. Guys, this one is very good from the brand. I love a few others, but this one is one of my favorites, so. Oh. Ten. Oh! So, this is sex. Hardcore. Yes! It's wow. dirty. Yeah, it's Oody. dirty. Yeah. Sexy. This is sex. I knew that Michelle would like this fragrance. Wow. Like, this is an intimidating wow. fragrance. Like, I show this to 80% uh, of the people that come over and most of them would hate it. And the other yeah, 20 don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. You love it? I so love it. Okay. Yeah, it's, I, the only thing that I smell now is oud, incense a little bit. Yeah. But it's also some dirty animalic yeah. in this and it's really good. Yeah, and it dries down. I will have to say those animalic notes, like with a lot of root fragrances, they start to kind of settle a bit, which, wow. On the skin, this one is incredible. Mm. Just received it the other day. 10. Kanja from Oman Luxury. Wow. Wow. I am in love with you this like brand. It. Yeah, yeah. You? Excuse me. <laughs> I've lived in Dubai way longer than you. Yeah, but I, I came here first. Really? I came here first. Yeah, yeah. When? I think 2017. Okay, fair enough. Yeah, yeah I was the girl at first. All though. right, all yeah. right. But I've been living here, so I'm like much more acquainted with oud. Even though you're known for your oud stuff, yeah, I love oud. Like I do really love it, and I feel like once you start to wear more and more oud fragrances, you kind of get over like this hump of like appreciating it. Uh, what people when they smell this first don't smell it like this. No. This is what you need to smell in the air behind some people when yeah. you walk behind them then you know how good it is definitely so. i agree 
totally. But in general, this brand, it blew my mind, actually. I have three fragrances from them. And the quality, like even the packaging, the bottles, the... I love it. Like yes. myself, I love their presentation. The juice is amazing. So very impressed. This was your only 10 so far. Yeah. Cool. Definitely. Would you wear cool. it? Yeah. Oh, I just wow. received it like a few days ago. So I, I really want to wear this one. 10. Going out. I'll wear it around me. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Give me the oud. <laughs> oh. Now, this one is also nice, but more likable for the normal people. <laughs> the normal people. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Yes. Um, I get the candy vibe in it again. Yeah. A lot of vanilla in this one. Yeah. <coughs> like cotton candy-ish. Yeah. But that's all I get. Okay. Yeah. Because it doesn't blow me away because I've smelled it before, but it is good. Yeah, but if it blows Oh, I have it. You have this one? <laughs> I love this one. It's a very nice, like, sweet cinnamon suede. Yeah. It's really good. It's really good. <laughs> wow. It's like the 25th interruption in this video today. Okay, there you go. So all these Arabian guys here, they smell so good. Oh yeah, they so smell good. They know. They know what's up. Yeah. Okay, this is a fresh one again. I think Ambroxan grapefruit. Yeah. It's nice. Um, but that Kanjar is in my head, you know. Now that I've smelled that, I'm like, nah. But it is really good. It is good. Okay. Um, hmm. For sports. Okay. Yeah, you buy sports outside. It's an expensive sports fragrance. Oh, that doesn't matter. <laughs> Just make sure you got the money. <laughs> yeah. Um, uh, nine. For for fresh fragrance, nine. I if this is off of a guy, it is really sexy. Yeah, yeah. It's a nice one. This one is mm. um, Mephisto from Casamirati. Oh damn. Yeah. I agree. This is like such a beautiful, high quality, rich guy summer fragrance for me. Yeah. Like it smells so refined as as a fresh fragrance goes. This one is super refined. Yeah, it's, it's like very nice. musky, like smooth, fresh, cool. Very fresh. I see it on like a guy in a white linen shirt. It's very classy. It works super well for business, for everyday, for casual, for signature scent. And also what's great about this one is that it lasts a long time on the skin. Like nice. as a fresh fragrance, it really lasts. It projects 10 out of 10 for me. Worth of your money. Sorry, eight. You said eight? Eight or nine. Eight okay. or nine. Bit too flowery for me, I think. <coughs> okay. I smell that it is fresh. I smell a little bit of musk. I like it. Okay. I would enjoy it on someone. I would give that someone a compliment, but maybe not on a man. Not on a man. For a woman, it's like seven and a half. I it's agree. also not that good. And okay. for a man, it's like a six. But I, yeah. Okay. This one was a flop. So this fragrance was a new one that I got from Nishane called Nanshi. Oh, okay. Nanshi, I think you're right oh. about what's inside. Like it's floral, musky, powdery. I, I really like it myself, but I uh, I respect your opinion. So yeah. this one was a flop. Nah, it's not bad. It's just not my thing. Spicy, uh, mm -hmm. fresh, spicy-ish. Yeah. I like it. Mm. Also a little bit sweet. Mm -hmm. No, for a date night I would enjoy it. Date night for sure. I love yeah. this one on a date. I, but I have the feeling it's close to the skin. Uh, yeah, you're right. It does project, but it's not like a beast mode sort of scent. No, so that's why I say date. Yeah. No, I like it. Mm. Uh, eight and a half. Eight and a half. Yeah. I also find this one to be. Kind of sexy. There's something that draws me into this fragrance a lot. Um, I just got it actually yesterday. It's from this brand called Plume. I discovered okay. it in Mexico, and this one was by far my favorite. It's called Ketal, and wow, it's like a smooth, patchouli, woody, sweet, spicy. Yeah, mm, I really like it a lot. Yeah, it's really nice for so, a date night. For a date night. Yeah, I'll take that. So eight and a half, you said. Yeah, it's good. Cool. Um, you you I know you like a lot of the same kind of fragrances. 
I, I, I've smelled this this one already like three times in this tent. No. Yeah, way. something like no this. Way. Yeah. It's like spicy, sweet. I like it. It's okay. good. Fine, I'm gonna go and pick up a few different ones as well to show you. <laughs> How long have we been filming? Yeah, it's fine. I can show you a few more. Eight. Eight? Yeah, it's good, okay, right? Okay, okay. I think I said date night in my okay, video as there, well. There you go. But it's good. Um, but <laughs> on skin, it's it much clean. better than eight. Okay, okay. Yeah, but okay. you have to uh, wear it on skin. Okay. Plus, you've just sprayed it, and this is gets better than dry down. True. Yeah. True. Okay, guys. So what I'm gonna do right now, I have a few other recommendations here, but I'm gonna scrap them and show Michelle all the dirtiest stuff because <laughs> I really want her. I want another ten or another like nine point nine from her. Okay. Like, uh, I need some more. So close your eyes. Okay. And I will figure it out. I tried to have a look around. I chose three. Not sure if you're gonna love them or you like them, but I did. I did my best. Let's we'll say. find out. We'll find out. Okay. Yeah, it's really good. Okay. This is more woody. Yeah. Woody burnt wood. Yeah. Ooh. Is this wood? Yeah. Yeah. It is. Oud. Oh, I wouldn't say that this is wood. Yeah, it's wood and very. It's good a nice wood. Very nice wood. Yeah. Smooth. Very smooth. Yeah. Nine and a half. Nine and a half? This is what I like. This is what we like to see on my channel. I want to see nine and a half. So. Yeah. Or ten, if possible. Yeah, but I'm a different kind of a woman. Not many women would go for this. It's just me, I think. Yeah, and but I think it's interesting because, you know, I don't talk about the more intense oud fragrances on my channel, so it's nice to. Yeah. Bring a light and also see what you think about them. Okay, okay so you like this one? Yes, I do. Nine and a half. Okay, it's like very. a... This brand is very, very expensive. Like the fragrances, they cost like $500. Like oh. it's super expensive, I'll show you. But the quality of the juice is crazy. Oh it's shit, I know that brand. Uh, it is really good. The fragrances. And I think you don't need wow. much with this one, right? You do not need no. a lot. Like I put like a tiny little dab of the oil in my hand, and I could smell it all day long. Like it's okay. super potent. Yeah. So you invest. Yeah, yeah. You invest, but the quality is amazing. And I really like this one because it's a very, okay. like Michelle was saying, super smooth oud with oris, with chocolate. It's oh, very nice. Oris and chocolate? Yeah, yeah. In the, in the fragrance. Okay, now that you say that. Exactly, yes. yeah. Focus on me. <laughs> Oh, it's really nice. It's nice. It's yeah. feminine. It's not feminine. Come on, it's like unisex. Okay, yeah, Perfectly unisex. unisex. But, okay, um, Arabian people will think like, yeah, unisex. And Arabian guys wear this. Yeah. But um, America, people that watch us the most, they will say, oh my god, it's feminine. What? You think so? Yeah. Okay, interesting. Because it's like very... Musky, sweet, little bit fruity, yeah. sweet. Yeah. yeah, they would see this more on a on a woman, but on a woman, it's also very good. Mm. May I see this one? I agree with what you said. You're 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 right. But me on a man, this one it pulls more smoky, which is really interesting. Okay. Like Pierre, this is one of his favorites actually. Okay. It's yeah, really I would good. like this on a man. Mm. I would. It's unisex. And you can tell this one it leaves a nice trail. Like you can just tell from the DNA of this scent, yeah. it's gonna leave a bismo trail. Oh, Oja. Oja, this one is Infusion Velour. Uh, it's like, a, like you said, fruity, you're pretty much spot on. Nice. Um, saffron, some woods, oud, but not that much oud, but no, more it's musk. Yeah, more musk. Uh, really nice, leaves like a captivating trail behind you. Yeah. And uh, in my opinion, it's very unisex. But uh, I see what you mean. In my opinion as well, but the Americans yes. will think like it's feminine. I can see her it's underwear good. slipping off right now. Yeah. Oh, this is really good. Skanky. Yeah. But I like it. Yeah. I do like not too skanky that you just stink, but like tiny bit of skanky that uh, intrigues me. I don't know. Mm. You're a dirty good. bastard. Yeah, this is That's what why. it's for, dirty bastard. Yeah. Ten. Yeah. A ten? Yeah, because I okay. like these kind of fragrances. Tiny bit skanky, oud, strong. Masculine. Does it feel like a it. quality juice or like more? Very high in quality. Mm. Good. Is it? It better be. <laughs> it smells like that. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. So it's a uh, Malaysia by uh, Zozov from the Oud Stars collection. This one, to be honest, I don't really wear it. I think I wore it like once 
and it did pull a little too skanky on me but Oh. Maybe I wore it at a premature time in my Uber. Yeah, when did you wore it? Like two, two years ago. Yeah, then so you need to try it I again. I need to try it again. But uh, it's very Super sexy. 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 Actually. Sexy. Yeah. Actually, it's not too skanky no, anymore it's for me. So you were a beginner. Yeah, I was maybe a beginner. I live in Dubai. <laughs> These were the top two. Yeah, super show. sexy. Yeah. But you gotta like Oud, guys. Like, this is not blind by worthy. I would no. say definitely not because you would go, Michelle, what are you doing? <laughs> but it's, um, if you like Oud, then it's really good. And both, I feel like both the quality is top tier for these yeah. two. So yeah, very high. Especially the can jar. Honestly, it blew me away when I smelled it. Blew me away. Blow chop you with? Yes. <laughs> okay. Demi forgot this one, but I also gave this one a 10. This one is also really good. I think I gave it a 10. You did? Yeah, it's good. Right, for the fresh ones, these were the best ones. So Mephisto from Casamorati and Sospiro Vibrato Fine. were her vibrator, were her top two like freshies. Yes. And then these three for the more oriental. You yeah. guys have heard me talk about Vinny Havan, you gotta get on it. And the two ouds, out of the two, I do prefer Kanja. You do? Yeah, I think okay. so. I'm gonna try to wear this one and see how it feels, but I love yeah. this fragrance. Oh my good. Wear it around me. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching this video. Uh, we're gonna go and film Michelle's video now, so make sure that yeah. you go over to Michelle's channel and watch it. Subscribe if you don't already, which I'm sure that all of you already follow Michelle because uh, why wouldn't you? So I'm sure why that you already do. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, we'll talk to you guys soon. Talk bye to bye. you guys soon. Bye bye. Bye.